I'd like to talk about YouTube as a way of publishing your own video. The advantage of using YouTube to publish your own video is you don't have to have a special player to play the video back. If you can uh, get to the internet with a browser, you can watch any video that's in YouTube. When you upload, you're going to be logged in as a specific user and that video is going to be connected to that account. So the top right hand corner, it shows you the account you're logged in as. Next to that is the upload button. If you click on the upload button, it gives you this box and if you drop a file inside of this big box, it'll upload the file. Now there's some settings here that control exactly who can get to your video. If you click on that, it shows public, unlisted, and private. Public means anyone can search for it, find it, and watch it. Unlisted means you can't find it just by searching. You have to know the link. But if you give me the link, and I give the link to a million people, a million people have the link and they can watch it. Private means only a person that uses an account that's approved can watch it. So I'm going to drag a file, drop it on the upload, and it's going to go through a two-step process. The file gets transferred to YouTube, and then it gets processed into a video that can be shown through the web browser. At this point, I can give my video a title. I can select if it's public, unlisted, or private. I can put in a description, and I can add tags. When the video is completely processed, it's going to generate some thumbnails and I can pick one of these thumbnails to represent my video in the little search engine. At this point I click the publish button and it publishes my video. When it's published I get a short URL and that's what I use to share with people who I want to see the video. If I go to that URL I can watch the video just like any other uh, YouTube video and if I ever want to change the settings on it, I can click, while I'm watching that video, I can click on Video Manager. It'll put me back into the screen where I can make changes to those things I set when I first upload the video. That's the short version of how to use YouTube to publish your own video.